race car what's going on guys welcome back to the channel as you can see i'm by myself because they're inside working on uh, our new project you guys want to see it want to see a new project you got a new project want to see it you want to see a new project i'll show you the new project but first look at this sun oh god that ooh. let me just race car sun but anyway let's go look Whoa, what are you guys doing in here? So, yep, there's the new toy, guys. Our 2002 Ram 2500. Yeah. With, with, look at this, look at that. I don't know if you can see it, because there's no light up here, but it's a Diesel. It's got, it's got one of them there Cummins in it. Man, sure. Right, so so Tom wants me to come over here and I don't know if I can squeeze through here <laughs> oh, Okay, oh, oh, uh oh, I'm stuck on the truck. Hold on boys. Oh, my belt got stuck All right, Tom, what do you want? So guys, if you guys don't know it, this truck actually used to belong to Jay's dad So Jay's dad decided that he wanted to sell it to somebody who would take care of it and respect it, so he sold it to Mikey. Think about it. I mean, we can go show him that. that we, um, I mean, he's got a solid point. Um, I'm over here doing God's work. Y'all are just trying to fuck. What? What are you doing? What? What? What are you doing? It got stuck because it's rusty. I don't need this judgment right now. All right. It's not, it doesn't want to come out because it has found a new home. This truck has lots of rust on it, guys. I don't know if you've realized this. Because it's an Ohio truck. Oh, it's called Ohio. Ohio. Yeah, literally. It came from, it came from Mexico to Ohio, and that's where it stayed. Yeah. It worked. Look at us solving stuff. If you're wondering what this is, it's a uh, bolt extractor and not a piston for a Brembo caliper. <laughs> so Tom and Mike are over there doing whatever they're doing. I'm I'm playing tool bitch, right? But not only am I tool bitch, I also not only do I do tool bitch, I feed them. <laughs> That's 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 what I do. I I feed the people that are working. I give them the chippy chippies. I give them the tooly toolies. You know stuff like that. No, I never took it out. So what's the what's the plans for the 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 the, the tow pig truck? Well, it runs like it's knocking. So we're gonna replace the spark plugs because it's not running right. And if that doesn't work, then the fuel injectors are next. I gotta go. <laughs> I'm just gonna walk out this door and just. No, no, seriously though, we did a compression check. Compression's way higher. It should be like fucking seven or eight since it's a six cylinder and it's more like 13, 16. Are you even talking about <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like sitting here like, what? Are you high? <laughs> How high are you right now? No, honestly though, my game plan is not to do a whole lot with it because I needed to tow other shit boxes that are super unreliable. So <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't yeah, need true. this to be unreliable. That's true. So, um, really, it's probably gonna get a cold air intake. Um, I'm thinking about doing everything Banks just because Banks knows what he's doing. Gail Banks is a gangster, and uh, I like that. He does what he wants, and no one tells him anything. That's a weird plug. Dude, Gail Banks is freaking awesome. <laughs> so, if you yeah. want to sponsor the truck, Gail, like, I mean, like everything he does in life, they're like, Gail, you can't do that. And he's like, fucking watch me. He is like, he is like the definition of hold my beer without alcohol. That is Gail's life, and he's awesome. Hold my starbs. Yeah, and now if I remember right, he's got a, uh, I think he's got a CT6 Blackwing. So he's he's got some twin turbo uh, V8 goodness from Cadillac. Had to finally retire his Marauder. That thing was cool too. Now, I think he's but, still got uh, the Marauder though. Yeah, but it's not as daily anymore. No. The Blackwing is. No, yeah. But uh, yeah, probably Gail Banks crossover. He has a big power one or a monster one. I don't know which one's better. I'm monster. just gonna call somebody and be like, tell me. And then cold air intake because um, why not? I'm not well. I'm not a yee boy, so like retaining factory water 
prevention or whatever does nothing for me. Um, this the only water this is going to see is rain or if I lose control like that Bugatti and slam into a lake. <laughs> um, he's not. He's not. He's not. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whoops. It's oh, gone. he he did. Mm -hmm. Other than that, I mean, it's it'll probably get full exhaust that a tuner. And, uh, and the crossover pipe. I've seen that what? that'll add a decent amount of efficiency to it. And Why full exhaust? It's already got half an exhaust. Why put more exhaust on it? Because not only is a full Less exhaust system better. actually made right, but it's also pretty lightweight. I can't. As opposed to just chopping off the back of the exhaust. I didn't chop it off, it rusted off. Whatever you want to say, man. It's weird that rust says saws all on the side of it, but <laughs> whatever, dude. <laughs> whatever. Um, but yeah, the, do that and really it'll just be efficiency mods after that Probably get a new intercooler once I can afford to do that because these things are beefy and expensive mm -hmm. and um, Because we have the powder coating oven that we haven't used for anything other than I did make cookies the other day did not go well Don't recommend and uh, <laughs> Powder coated a couple wrenches no, That was I before we had that oven that. though. That's fully put together now so we haven't used that yet, but I know that like, if you open it up, it looks be, like the inside of the space station. That can be, this can be, I'm going to powder coat all of this. No, just lift up on the handle. There you go. Oh, shiny. <laughs> oh, and as another type of uh, lifestyle mod, I bought these really cheap eBay LEDs. They're like six inches. And if you watch one of our previous video, I put four of them, I think, in the back of the BMW and it makes it look like daylight in the trunk probably gonna do that to this hood because this hood is huge and bulky and I can put them like here right and they will shoot down and light all this up so if I ever have a problem I will be able to see it other than that it's just gonna be a lot of cleaning and uh, trying to make this thing look nice because it wasn't cleaned a whole lot ever I blame it, you. no no he got a bath like YouTube once help me and blame him. He got a bath once mm -hmm. they washed it when he bought it and then it rained on it a lot. Oh, and I might put an electric it fan. It splashed on the side of the road. Yeah. I might put an electric fan on it too. One, because any type of resistance on your rotating Gosh. assembly robs horsepowers. And two, uh, I want to be able to turn it on because if I go to the track, whatever car, especially that janky ass BMW, it's probably not going to have air conditioning. So I want to be able to sit there with the AC on and turn the fan on and keep the truck from getting too hot. And that's the uh, that's the game plan for under the hood for the outside of the truck. I have no idea. It's probably not getting a lift kit, but otherwise. Uh, we talked we talked about leveling it though, maybe. Yeah, it might get a leveling kit. Um, I'm gonna find some. Sort and we got to do the one wheel bearing sometime. I have that wheel bearing. Sometimes. I know we just we just have to do it sometime. Yeah, brakes first. I yeah. need to be able to like drive it. Um, yeah. Because I don't think then, the wheel uh, bearing is actually shot. It's just about to go. And then because I'm not an asshole and I refuse to run a 52 inch light bar riding around inside of town and be like, that's my brides and blind to piss out everybody. Uh, I found a company through one of the Facebook pages that retrofits these headlights and it gives it a beautiful cutoff and I can make it match the color of the truck. And Timpson is in the middle of helping us decide the color of the truck. Try it. Mm -hmm. Everybody's going to put in on it. Feel free to comment. I have no idea whose opinion I'm going to take. I might even just like go and see what paints on Clarence and that'll be the color. I, if we can't come to an agreement or if, I, if something really doesn't sound pretty in my mind, then I'm just going to be like, what do you have that's super cheap? And they'll be like, hot pink and baby shit green. And I'll be like, that's what it is then. And then I'll ride the line over it because I'm not riding around in a trash ass vehicle. So, so yeah, in, in the comments, <laughs> comment on what color you think the truck should be. Right now it is, they call it graphite gray. I don't know if you can really see it in the camera, but yeah, it needs some paint work. It's, it's got its typical Dodge clear missing. But yeah, so uh, check it out. A few moments later. So as you get, what, what are you doing? This is why nobody watches our videos. I like, I like that you chose the fucking jack stand instead of the actual drift handle sitting over there. <laughs> but that, that's my shifter. Oh god, you left it there. Bam, 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 bam. Car die? You saw it? <laughs> Can't drive a manual? I gotta drive a manual. I 
I can't drive it. Bunch of fucking morons, I swear. So anyway, as you can see, the truck's not in the garage anymore. We're done with it for the night, day, whatever. Uh, we gotta wait on some parts. We need new bleeder screws, because um, the bleeder screws on that truck are screwed up. So, you get those parts, we'll get the truck back in probably in a week or two, ish. Well, the parts will be here on Wednesday and Friday, so. Uh... Just depends on what we're doing next weekend. We're not 100% sure yet. Yeah. Uh, but, and because by next video, weekend. It'll be silent and it'll have music because I'll be dead on my feet because I'm busy all next weekend. So I'm gonna so, get like two hours of sleep and come out here. Yeah, if we make a video of it, that's, it's just gonna be time lapse. So, uh, that was a short video of you guys showing um, the toe pig, also known as the Crummins. The fuck it is. Ah. That's what Rock Bucket Motor told us to call it, so we're gonna call it the Crummins. Ow! <laughs> so anyway, hope you guys liked the video. If you don't, well, like it anyway. And uh, subscribe if you don't already subscribe and click the bell so you know when we post. So, Mikey! We got spark plugs for the truck. <laughs> Tom! <laughs> I'm raiding. Bye! Bye, friends! Gang, gang. <laughs> I've got friends, I've got family. <laughs> <laughs>